Imagine a life where you would be able to wake up and feel just so grateful for your life. You're not trying to strive for the next business idea. You're not trying to make the next million dollars. But you kind of just step back and you enjoy life. Well, in this video, I'm going to show you guys a thing that you can start doing to start living a life like that. Let's get right into it. What's going on guys? This is Caleb from A New Expression where we help you become your greatest self. Now, excuse this bed hair. I just woke up and I was thinking about, you know, I might as well hop in a shower, but then I was like, you know, I wanted to make this quick video for you guys. So, don't mind the bed hair. I uh, put on a hat for you guys if you guys prefer. All right, we're doing this. So, now, as you guys know, you guys know me, that I love to study and examine the most, sorry, I had to fix my camera right there, but the most successful people. And I try to, you know, distinguish and try to see what they do on a daily basis. And what I realized is that a lot of these people, most of the most successful people, do this one thing and they they express this either in the morning or at night and what that one thing is is gratitude now i'm sure you guys know what gratitude is i'm sure you guys have heard of heard of of gratitude but what really is it how can we start practicing it um in our daily lives um i think a great thing about gratitude is that is that no matter where you are in the world, no matter what your circumstances, no matter what your situation might be in life right now, it doesn't matter if you're having financial problems, it doesn't matter if you're having relationship problems, but this is something that you can still express. This is still something that you can practice in your daily life, no matter how hard life might be. Um, this could actually flip that all around. This could actually change your life. And it's very small steps. It's something that you can start practicing for five or ten minutes a day, but the amount of results and the amount of, you know, the benefit that you get from this is so profound. So let's get right into it. I'm going to give you guys three things that you guys can start doing to start developing more gratitude in your life. Now, the very first thing is to express gratitude in the morning and at night. Um, this can be for five or ten minutes but just setting aside that time in your day to express gratitude. Um, just like for you guys that do meditation, um, just like that, it's like the same kind of practice, but it's kind of like a gratitude uh, meditation. But really just setting aside five or 10 minutes a day can profoundly impact your life. And as Tony Robbins says it, man, if you can't, if you can't set aside five to 10 or 20 minutes out of your day, then you don't have a life. Right, we all we all can spare five or ten minutes throughout the day just to express gratitude. And really it's it's beneficial for you. So you should really prioritize this, right? It should be something that you could prioritize just five or ten minutes out of the day to, to express gratitude. Now what we're gonna do um, to express gratitude is um, for you guys that have done meditation, uh, really you just want to you know, you don't want to lean your back against anything, but you want to have your back straight and just like meditation, take some deep breaths, right? Take some deep breaths. And I want you to ask yourself two questions. Two questions, just two questions, that's it. Um, so the first question is, what am I most grateful for today? You know, what am I most grateful for today? Um, and really, really think about that. And the second question is going to be, and how does that make me feel? So just the two questions. So what am I most grateful for today? You know, it could be family. It could be the fact that you're alive, the fact that you have shelter, the fact that you have a home to stay at, the fact that you can get your bills paid. And how does that make you feel? You know, and, and what these questions, do, what this question does is that it shifts your attention to what you're most grateful for. So now you're putting your attention on the things that you're most grateful for and and the question, how does it make me feel, is you're, you're getting in tune with that emotion. You're, you're building that emotion of gratitude, and you're, you're, you're feeling it in your body. 
And what you want to do with this exercise is that you want to really feel the gratitude. So when you when you think about what you're most grateful for, really feel the emotion that that comes with, right? Feel that emotion and really try to expand it. And while you're while you're taking these deep breaths, you know, think about when you're inhaling. Think about inhaling the gratitude. Think about inhaling, you know, the the gratitude that you have for the things around you. And when you're exhaling, I want you to think about think about it like you're exhaling gratitude, exhaling gratitude to the things around you. So when you inhale, you're inhaling gratitude, and when you're exhaling, you're exhaling gratitude to the things around you. So that's the first thing that you guys can do. Now the second thing that you guys can start doing is to make a gratitude journal. All right, this this hat is going off. It's been annoying me. So develop a gratitude journal, and so. I can make a whole separate video on this. This is a whole topic for another day. Um, if you guys do want me to make this video, comment down below and let me know, and I will definitely put that out for you guys. But, so developing a gratitude journal. So what you would do with this journal, right? Um, every day in the morning or at night, uh, it doesn't really matter, but in the morning or at night, list out, list out three things that you're most grateful for, you know? And if you're in a stage in your life where you can't find a lot of things to be grateful for, or it's hard for you to um, distinguish what what that is that you're grateful for, then just list out three things that have helped you and assisted you today. You know. So now, you know, if you can't find something that you're grateful for, um, find something that has has helped you. Uh, like for example, if you were going to work, instead of having to walk, you know, you have a car and you have a car that you could drive, you know, that's helping you, that's making your life easier. So just list out, you know, three things that you are either grateful for or three things that have helped you um, in your day today. And what this is doing is it's training your mind, right? It's training your mind to see the positive. It's training your mind to interpret things that you might have not interpreted. Um, it's developing a more you know, more gratitude in your life. It's shifting your attention to to gratitude in your life. And so as we do this on a day-to-day -day basis, we're, we're training our mind to see the positive. You know, I, I'm not sure where I saw this phrase from, but what you focus on and what you put your attention on is what grows. So when you when you put your attention on gratitude, when you put your attention on the things that you're grateful for, that that in your life grows that that gratitude in your life will grow just by listing out the things that you're grateful for every single day you're training your mind to see the positive you're training your mind and you're training yourself to be more grateful for life and you guys will notice this when you when you um when you practice gratitude when you practice you know, listing out the things that you're grateful for, you'll realize that those days you'll feel greater about yourself. You know, when you're going through this meditation exercise, when you're going through the gratitude exercise that I gave you in the first exercise, you guys will notice a shift in attitude. You guys will notice a shift in emotions. And that that emotion, that energy, you'll carry around with you for the rest of your day. You know, you'll feel different. And, you know, things that might have you know, annoyed you, things that might have gotten on your nerves, those things don't affect you as much because you already built this energy around you and that that stops other things from really getting to you. So, so you know, develop, you know, whether it be five or ten minutes, try to develop this kind of gratitude every single day. Um, I know I struggle with this, guys. I'm not perfect. Um, it's not like I have this set down and on a day-to-day -day -day schedule. It's not a habit for me yet. But I would love to develop this habit, and I realize the importance of this. And I really realize, you know, throughout the day, the days that I do express gratitude are the days that I feel a lot better. So, now, this is still something I'm trying to practice in my everyday life, but uh, really practicing it and setting aside five or ten minutes just to practice it can uh, provide tremendous results for you guys. Now, the third thing that you guys can start doing to develop more gratitude is throughout the day, Right, whether you're in traffic, whether you're just laying down um, in bed, or whether you're at work on your desk doing work, take a moment to just take a deep breath. Right, take a moment just to just to relax and just to 
keep your mind and to cleanse your mind of whatever you're doing. Right? Oftentimes when we're working, we're, we're working and we have that kind of mindset. We're just, our mind is just going, going, going. And we don't take time to just relax. We don't take time to just enjoy life as it is. Right? If we're in traffic, we're just thinking about, oh, like these cars are going so slow. I just want to get home and all of these things. But they're not going to change your situation. If you're in traffic and you're just expressing all this hate and anger, you're like, why is it like this? You know, why Why are these people going so slow? What is happening? You know, your your mind is just going and rambling about all these negative things. When it's not changing the situation, you, you thinking these thoughts and you thinking this kind of, you know, negative, negative things isn't going to change the traffic. That's not going to change anything about the traffic. It's not going to make the cars go by faster. It's not going to change the person that's driving. So, so... Take that into consideration. Change what you can control. And what you can control is your attitude towards these certain things. And gr gratitude is much like an attitude. It's an attitude to life or towards life. So, so develop a, a gratitude. So when you're, you're in traffic, just step back and just express gratitude. Right? There's no harm in doing this. It's, it's benefiting you tremendously so you know either when you're at work or whatever you you're conscious of this whenever this pops up and you remind yourself to develop more gratitude step back relax and just very much like the first exercise just express gratitude to wherever you are um in that day you know wherever you, whether you're at work whether you're in traffic whether you're just driving commuting just express gratitude for wherever you are um, and as you express gratitude, and as you start expressing gratitude more, you start developing more gratitude in your life. And it becomes easier to express gratitude. It's very much like a skill. You want to start developing and, and start practicing gratitude more in your life. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Remember that, you know, five or ten minutes can go a long way. And, you know, gratitude is something that you, that anyone can do. Um, and I think that's why it's so great. Anyone can express gratitude. Uh, and, you know, it's, it's really much about like that phrase where you see, see the glass half full instead of half empty. It's very much like that. You're seeing life in a more positive light. Right? You're seeing, you know, no matter what your situation is, you're seeing your situation in a more positive light. This channel is much about just improving yourself in all areas of your life. Uh, whether that be happiness, personal development, just in all areas of your life. And gratitude can take you so far in each of these areas. And it just, it, it helps you to realize that, that your situation doesn't mean that you can't be happy. That you can be happy um, no matter what your circumstances. So make sure you guys subscribe to this channel if you guys want more content like this, more videos like this. And yeah, remember that change happens only with a new expression. And I will see you guys in the next video. Take care.